this is Anna. Welcome to my channel. So we're going to make a uh, meatballs sweet and sour. So what we have right here is our onion. I have celery, garlic, ketchup, a mixture of red, yellow, and orange pepper. So I have chili powder, red pepper, pineapple chunk, our salt and pepper for taste and of course this is gonna be our uh, flavor for our sauce that's gonna be a abalone sauce and of course our mixture of um, meatballs that we're going to make so this is just like a salt a little bit of salt pepper parsley and instead of using a uh, flour or egg to Bind. So what I use right here is a crushed crackers. So this is gonna be our meatballs. Okay, we're going to start frying our meatballs and then make the sauce. Okay. Okay, there you go, guys. So we'll start frying our meatballs. So there you go. So you can make like one and a half or one inch of uh, meatballs so it will not gonna be overwhelming size you know what I'm saying so what we do is just do like that I'm just gonna lower down the heat a little bit so it will cook through And if you doesn't have time, you can make your meatballs ahead and all you need is just the sauce later on. That would work too. Okay. Then we'll just continue making our meatballs and fry them. So there you go guys, after frying our meatballs, so this is our meatballs that we uh, fry a while ago and this is just like just so delicious and you can see the brownness right there that's what we're looking for so what we're going to do is start making our sauce okay okay we'll just turn this on okay we'll start on our celery Our beautiful onion okay. we'll mix our garlic I guess we can just finish up the garlic <laughs> it's beautiful So all we have to do is just to take them for 30 seconds. Alright, so after 30 seconds, so everything is sauteed. So that's the celery, onion, and garlic. So what I'm going to put in is our mixture of pepper. A little bit of ketchup this ketchup will give color to our sweet and sour and the tanginess that will balance also for our pineapple like that okay and we will add pepper 
the chili powder. Oh, I can smell the beautiful combination of our herbs. Okay, and of course, I want a little spicy for this recipe. There you go. But I mean, you can just reduce the red pepper if you can handle the heat. Like that, beautiful. Mm, good. All right. And of course, our pineapple chunks. Okay. So all we have to do is just pour the juice and so is the pineapple, and it will give flavor to our meatballs too. Okay. See the combinations of colors, guys. Beautiful. Of course, put a little bit of salt. And of course, our abalone sauce. Just a little bit of drop. And all we have to do is just reduce this beautiful mixture that we have right here. And then once everything is reduced, you know, we'll just dump the meatballs into our pan. And we'll just simmer them for another minute or two, okay? There you go guys, after a couple of minutes of um, boiling up this beautiful pineapple, mixture of uh, pepper, celery, onion, and garlic. So if you notice, this is pretty much reduced now right there. That's what we're looking for. So all we have to do now is put in our meatball. Okay, just like that. And if you notice, I put the meatballs uh, at the end of our sauce, so it will not gonna be saggy. So you can still have the texture and the crunch of the meatball. So what we have to do is just like that. Okay, mix it up. That's beautiful, this right there. Mmm, yum. My husband is not excited for this. Beautiful. Okay, so all we have to do is just do the plating. Alright. So there you go, guys. So this is our meatball, sweet and sour. So this is pretty much easy right here. So all I have right here is just a pineapple mixture of pepper. I have the red, yellow, and the orange pepper right here. So I have the celery, onion, and garlic chili powder red pepper salt and pepper to taste so i hope you enjoy my beautiful dish today and this is delicious and my my husband is just so excited to try this beautiful dish so once again guys thank you very much for watching and please don't forget to subscribe and i am on youtube and once again see you later bye